Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so right next to me, I have a bunch of things that I just opened. Um, so if you guys want to stick around and see the stuff that I got in my Shein haul, um, stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so I didn't really brush my wig, but it's okay. Um, this wig looks good even if it's not brushed. I really like it. So it's just a way of like self-expression and things like that. So I wanted to go hop on. I just, when I got home, I got this big package. I've ordered so many things online that I don't even know what this is exactly. Um, but here it is. So I'm gonna do a quick, um, kind of like unboxing or opening up like a little haul video. I have no idea what this is. Um, I don't know, I need to brush the wig a little bit, but like I said, the wig looks good without it actually being brushed as much. I'm trying to figure out where I want to put like the bangs and things like that. But, so I got this wig off of, I think, um, Amazon. So it's a synthetic wig, but I mean, it gets the job done. Um, I think it would look a lot prettier if I had my face done and things like that. But the purpose of me wearing wigs is just kind of changing up my hair when I feel like it uh, with like minimal effort. And this is like pretty minimal effort. Like I think if I could like kind of just like walk the streets, people really wouldn't know that this isn't really my hair. It's just that I'm just so picky, I know. Um, so let's just get straight into it. I'm going to open it up. I really have no idea because it doesn't even say exactly where it's from. It just says that it's from China. <laughs> so that's promising, right? <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, so I realized that this video is going to be a Shein haul. Um, I don't know if you guys say Shein, Shine, Shin, um, but I say Shein. That's what I like to say. Um, I think that's just, I mean, Shein. <laughs> S-H-E-I-N. So, um, so I'm going to do a quick Shein haul for you guys. I just, I had just made this order maybe like not even a week ago and it came by so quick. So per, in my personal experience with Shein, I love it. I love it because all this stuff is like things that you can't get around here. It has all the great pastel colors that you could dream and ask for. Um, the sizing, if you just look at the measurements very carefully, um, you usually would get your size. Not all the time. I would say that there's some items that I've kind of like overestimated or underestimated on the size a little bit but for the most part they still fit but it's just more so like my preference i um i'm just really self-conscious about my body right now so i'm working on that so like there's like a whole i'm gonna be making like a um video series of um different things that i'm gonna do to kind of get myself back into where i want to be um, i don't know if i want to wear glasses or no glasses I didn't put on a wig cap or anything like that. I just kind of threw it on. I mean, I'm pretty sure if I styled it, it would look so much better or, or brushed it and stuff, but it is what it is. <laughs> so I'm gonna take it off real quick. Um, so there's some dresses that I've gotten from Shein that are, they look better with like strapless bras. So the first thing I did as soon as I got some dresses, I was like, dang, I don't have any bras to wear it with. So I ordered some um, strapless bras. And I ordered the largest size just because like just around here, I'm a little wider. So the best thing for me to do is just kind of pick out bras that would like fit. Um, so this is a black one. And the uh, Shein um, items, they come in like little packages like this, kind of like in a little bag shape. So it's really nice and compressed. That's why I, that's what I like about it so much. And um, yeah, so I got like a little strapless black bra. And it looks really, really nice. And I think it's going to fit just based on like how wide it looks. So I got this. I got them in two colors. I got them in a black color and a tan color. So inside your Shein package, they usually have like um, little return labels. Like if you get an item and you don't like it or it doesn't fit, you can, you can return it. That's not a big issue. So... I also got my my hubs the um, a little bucket hat or the man's you know got him a little bucket hat so it's really cute it has like little dinosaurs on them and you can't really see them like little dinosaurs how 
bad does this wig look on right now? Like, okay, I said it looks okay, not rush, but like, I'm just super self conscious. I don't know. <laughs> I'm just, I'm trying to work on self confidence and like just feeling good, like anytime I want and just not let anyone tell me how I should or should not feel. Um, so one day, one day at a time, right? Oh, okay. I like it. This wig looks fine. Um, I got this really cute, I saw this. Um, so I'm born in the year 1992. And I got this really cute like little uh, wristlet or bracelet and it says 1992 on it. See, this is the kind of things that you can get on there. Super cute. Oh yeah. Okay, so I got, I hope these fit. I might do a video of trying them on later. I'm not gonna try them on now. I'm just gonna show you guys what they look like essentially. So I got some like pants type stuff that I can wear. Um, with like everyday clothing so I so I normally like to dress in like big tees and like colorful shirts and things like that so these are just some like jogger type pants and they're tan because I have a lot of black pants so I'm trying to like you know brown up my wardrobe colors a little bit um, so they're like jogger type and yeah so um, if I end up liking some of these and or I end up keeping them then usually what I'll do is I might take photos of like my outfit of the day and if you guys want to see my outfit of the day or um, for me to do videos, just let me know. But my outfits of the day, <laughs> so my outfits of the day are typically posted on my Instagram, which is also the same handle, which is, I can't even talk. It's Chibi Fan X3. Um, so that's where I put them. So these look really, really nice. I think they're going to fit. I don't know if anyone else does like the neck measurement thing. I do. Um, but I got them um, kind of stretchy. And I usually order um, like a size up or I look at the measurements pretty closely. And then it usually helps whenever they have um, pictures of like people who reviewed them too. And I'll look at their body type just to see if it kind of matches my body type a little bit or um, anything remotely close. So that's how I kind of base on the sizing that I'll go with. So I range anywhere from like, um, so I'm a little heavier now. So I buy clothes anywhere from like an XL or um, or even a uh, zero like, like it, it hops into their like plus size but because these clothes are made from China like don't feel discouraged if it's like in the plus size section like honestly um, because if you like to wear oversized stuff like me you're gonna like sometimes hop over there and that's totally fine that is totally fine um, but usually I would go towards like the XL just because I like my things to be a little um, looser and they'll fit, but I like them to be a little looser. So it just depends on what you're wanting from that. I think I got probably the same exact pants in black. So yeah, so these are the same exact pants, but in black, I think. Let's find out. So yeah, so it's the same exact pants, but it's just in black. And if you look at the material, they look super comfy. Like they're not super thick, and that's why I was trying to get. I wasn't wanting any pants that um was like sweatpants material like I wanted them to look kind of like where I can dress them up or dress them down just depending on my mood so that's what I did there um, oh this is cute I got this see for example this is like a zero XL um, and I just got I got it that large because I want it to be this is kind of like a uh, lounge set um, so it has like biker shorts and like a t-shirt and I wanted it to be loose and I wanted it to be nice and comfy, kind of like a big Barbie doll. So um, they're nice and stretchy. I think they look kind of big, but um, they might be looser than I expected, but it's okay. So like, I don't know, okay, they're not biker shorts, they're more like pants. See, they look really wide, but I think I was kind of, at the time when I was shopping, I wanted them to be um, nicely loose and just comfy. I don't like to feel constricted just because I'm just, I'm really self-conscious about my body. Um, and I just want to be comfortable anytime and anywhere. So yeah, so it's just a simple like, um, like lounge set. I can't even think of the word. Um, so just to kind of give you guys like an idea of my measurements. So my waist is like anywhere from a 30 to 31 now. Um, so that kind of gives you an idea of how I size, size my items. Um, I just like them kind of big. So my waist is between 30 and 31. My hips are about like a 44. I know, right? <laughs> just, 
so this is the other bra that I was talking about. Um, I wanted them, I wanted it tan. It looks a little bit more yellow in person, but that's okay. Um, so here it is. It's like a tan neutral color. It looks more yellow um, on the page. So that's the kind of things that you'll get from Shein. Sometimes um, the things might be a little off, but not too, too much. Like, and all the stuff that I've ever bought from Shein, I've never had that issue before. Um, where it's like a big issue, like something's like, oh no, I don't want it because it looks nothing like the photo. At least it gives me like a similarity. Like this is going underneath my clothes. No one's going to see this. The whole purpose of me getting a strapless bra is so that no one sees it. So I'm okay with it. I just want it to be neutral enough to where it doesn't like show through um, certain clothes. If it's like a, um, lighter color outfit. And so this is what I'm talking about. Like, so this is like, it shows you like the return process. Um, it usually comes inside the packaging. It tells you how to return it. It gives you like different labels that you can use to return your items. Uh, I'm going to keep this just in case something doesn't fit exactly how I want it. Um, oh, this, I don't even remember ordering, <laughs> ordering this. Like, I, I just, I remembered the main thing of me going on Shein that day was to get the bras. So let's see. Oh, this is so cute. So this is a little um, purple dress. Okay, I think I got this way too big. I don't know. Sometimes um, I'll try it on just to see. But this is really cute. I think it's gonna be, oh no, it might fit. Ooh, I got a I've gotten, it's okay. This is really cute. It's okay to be, I, I'd rather be comfortable. So um, this is a really cute dress. This is in the size I'm pretty sure I got this in an XL. It just might look big like this, but um, if you guys are about my measurements, so my cup size, I'm a 34C around. Uh, my waist is like a 30, 31, and my hips are like a 44, and I'm only 4'11", so I just like things to look. Um, so this will be a little longer on me. It might be short on some other people, but on me, it's pretty. Um, oh, this is so pretty. Like, I look at the color on camera. It is so pretty. So this is a nice little Shein kind of like spring summer type dress. Um, I like to dress like it's spring all year round. <laughs> so <laughs> it's okay. So I'm gonna put this in here. Hopefully it fits like the way I want it. Again, if it doesn't, I have like the return um, labels in here somewhere. Like it has like different return labels. Um, so I can return it if I don't like it. I also got, I'm ridiculous. I don't know why I ordered this dress twice. I've already ordered this dress before, and for some reason I ordered it again. That's just, I don't know why I did that. I looked at my shopping cart to see what was coming, and I thought it was like, oh, maybe it was just an error on the webpage. But I made this error, and I ordered it again. So um, maybe I ordered it in a big, I don't know what my thought process was, but I am going to return this because this is, why I don't want to have two, dress, two, two of the same exact dresses. But this is really, really cute. It's just a nice little um, kind of like netty type dress with like daisies on it. I don't know what I was thinking. It's really cute, but if I already have the same exact dress, I'm going to return it. Like I know I have it already, but I don't know what the thought process. Maybe I ordered a different size or I'm going to have to look at that and then let you guys know in the next vlog or video or something. Um, what the heck? <laughs> Um, I got this for um, Nicholas, um, for my man's. Um, I got this for him, this is super cute. So it's like, so they sell a bunch of men's stuff on there as well, which I love because it's not only like made for women, it has like men. Um, I think there's some pet stuff on there too, actually. And for kids, women's, like all that stuff on there. So this is just a really cute, like two piece set um, for top and bottom. And I'll just give you guys a quick little sneak peek because I want him to be the one to actually like you know, I'll just let you guys I, I want him to be the first to open it, but um, I usually get him a size large. His waist is like a size 34. So to kind of give you guys an idea, if you guys want to shop for your guys too, um, it's really cute. I'll throw that on there. Um, I got him a beanie also because he likes beanies just like I do. And it has like little dinosaurs on it as well. And then, I think this is the final item. I'm really mad I ordered two of the same dresses. What was I thinking? 
probably wasn't thinking honestly i was just kind of like we like you know the tiktok videos where they go we 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 <laughs> i'm sorry um i'm most excited about this so in texas um the weather's been kind of crazy so it's snowed it got hot start raining gets windy gets hot again um and so sometimes you never really know so sometimes i like to have like a little cardigan or sweater or some kind of hoodie that's like thin material just enough to kind of like embrace like embrace the wind that's kind of blowing at us but not really like making me sweat so i saw a really really cute rainbow cardigan how thinking cute is this look at this i love it so much and look at it with the wig honestly the wigs like the way it's like sitting down is growing on me now so I don't care if it looks kind of like frizzy like i think that's the only thing that has bothered me is how frizzy it is right now but you know that's what you get with synthetic wigs but regardless i would totally just walk out the house in this same exact way and in this cardigan like look at this <laughs> i love it so it has like hot pink yellow this turquoise type of color this baby blue and then this lighter pink up here and I got this in the XL, well, no, in a one uh, XL because I wanted to be like oversized. I think I overestimated how big I wanted it, but like I said, I like my things to be oversized. So, and I'm not, I, I typically don't wear plus sizes in like H&M or Forever 21 or Nordstrom and things like that. It's just more so with Shein, um, their measurements are a little different. So you can look at the model sizes, look at what sizes they're wearing, look at their body type. And so don't feel discouraged, um, even though I felt a little discouraged, just a little bit buying from that section, but it's okay. Um, oh, I love this. I'm gonna probably wear this tomorrow. <laughs> I love this so much. I should wash it because, you know, COVID. So I'm probably gonna wash it first and then wear it, but I really like it. So this is basically my haul i'm going to have to um look at shein and see um when i can go drop that off at the post office that extra dress i got because i'm pretty mad at myself that i got two of them um but yeah thanks so much you guys for watching i had no idea what kind of video this was going to be in the beginning i just knew that i wanted to do a shein haul when well, i i just knew that i wanted to do a shopping haul um, so I saw the package, I opened it, and it just so happened to be Shein. So typically when I do Shein packages, they kind of come in like big white bags and it's all neat and compressed. But this is the first one that had FedEx on it, so I wasn't really sure. Um, because I also do a lot of like, um, I buy things from personal shoppers in Japan too. And so I wasn't sure if it was like from them. Um, usually, you know, like th that does come through like surface mail, DHL, and things like that. But, you know, I, again, I wasn't sure, so... So there goes that. <laughs> um, but okay, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry for all of the wee, wee, wee. <laughs> um, but I'll see you guys next time. Bye.